Hello guys, today we have uh, some guidance how to replace battery for the Bank and Olsen speaker BioPlay P2 version and actually the charging capacity here right now is very low, only 30 minutes it can hold and all the time you need to use the uh, wired charger to listen to music so there is some solution to replace a battery and I've got a battery from AliExpress from Cameron Cena that's a brand and it's not hard per hours exactly for Bioplay P2 replace 7.4 volts so actually looks quite high quality from this brand so let's dismantle the speaker replace a battery and test it out so I turn it on to check whether everything working Okay, so you see it's working, everything's fine, normal. So let's turn it off. Here is a button, by the way, and this one is touch. All right, so let's check out the battery first. So the quality of package is quite nice. And the battery here fixed very tight. All right, let's put all the things aside. That's how the battery looks like. Actually, the model of the battery is C129D2. It's a part number, and the model is CC uh, CSBNP 200SL. 7.4 volts, 900 milliampere, 6.66 watt hours. Lithium polymer battery pack. From this side, nothing, and such connector. All right, so let's put the battery uh, somewhere here and let's dismantle it first so first of all you need to put off the top cover all right it should be quite tight it's more convenient to do it with metal thing i doesn't have it so i've got only plastic one All right, so one clip is out. It's getting much easier to do it later on. All right, two clips out. So actually it took really fast. All right, so we have this metal cover up. Looks like this. Then you need to unscrew how many? Six, yeah, six screws. So let's do it. Let me find out the most suitable one. Okay, this one maybe. Yeah, fit perfect. It's really tight. For the first time. quite long screw actually okay let me unscrew it All right, so we've opened the speaker itself. Now it's time to check out our battery and replace it. So as you see, it should perfectly fit here. We also have one screw. I don't know whether it's fixed. Yeah, seems like it's fixed. Need to unplug the battery first. Okay, it's just on the glue, I guess. 
Okay, so we are here. Batteries out. The new battery is here. So basically that's how it looks like. It's I think more or less same, maybe for the weight itself, almost very similar. So let's put a battery back. Let's connect it first. This way, I guess. Uh -huh. Connector is same. So everything should fit. Okay, battery fixed. We should do it the same way. Like that. Okay. Seems the battery is fine. So let's see that everything fit and close it. Okay, let's turn it on to test it out. Okay, seems we have light, so it's working. Everything file. Now let's put everything back. Let's turn it off. It's still working. All right, so it's off. Let's put everything apart. And should work fine. Okay, let's use a screw.
and let's close the cover back okay should work fine let's turn it on yeah it's working so basically that's pretty much it it took around 10 minutes to replace it the old battery is out already so the new battery is here it's from 2017 so six years and it's actually a bit too big for now so i think it's already a time to forget about this battery and we have a new battery everything works bottoms works so that's pretty much it thank you very much for watching put the thumbs up and see you next time